when we're talking about fear and joy, I think Jeff Bridges was talking about the, being friends with fear and, um, and joy, that combination that you can have fear and joy in acting and, and that mm. you have to make friends with fear. And I guess, you know, when I'm scared and I have stage fright and all that stuff, I think of that and um, I don't know, it makes me kind of Were you scared excited. when you went into Three Billboards? Always, always scared, yeah, sure. Of what? Of sucking, of, uh, <laughs> you know, of all that stuff, you know, you're scared all the time. I mean, I was scared when I was doing the play Fool for Love that I would rope shitty when Ed Harris came because he'd done the original production. <laughs> yeah. And thank God I roped good when he came, yeah. You wrote good when I came. So. Good, good. <laughs> did, did you talk about that with Martin McDonald when you did, the, did it, or what were those conversations? I think that I had the luxury of a lot of time. I went down to southern Missouri and I did some ride-alongs with cops and stuff like that. And, oh. uh, you know, you got, you know but it that's interesting. Me, was that yeah. <laughs> a good it, or bad they, experience? How they treat you as yeah. a celebrity ride-along? Mm -hmm. They were great. A guy named Josh McCullen, he taped my lines in a tape recorder. My, my dialect coach, Liz Himmelstein, found uh, a cop, and Martin didn't want much of an accent, so I said, you know, Liz, I think we're gonna have to tape another cop. This cop doesn't have enough of an accent. We found another cop, went down there, did some ride-alongs. Hey, fuckhead! What? Don't say what, Dixon, when she comes in calling you a fuckhead, and don't you Shut come up. in here. You get over here. No, you get over here. All right. What? Don't, Dixon! What? I'm you do not allow a member of the public to call you a fuckhead in this station house. That's what I'm doing. I'm taking care of it in my own way, actually. Now get out of my ass. Mrs. Hayes, have a seat. What is it I can do for you today? Well, the three billboards is heavy and it's funny. It's both, So, but but I think we laughed a lot, especially Woody Harrelson, who's, a, who's fun to laugh with. But, you know, I think when you're doing a heavy topic, you gotta have some laughs, don't you think? I mean, you gotta have some levity in between. Do you? Know? Yeah. Yeah. Because it's too heavy for 12, 14 hours. Do you take right? those characters home with you, or do they affect you in a negative way? I, uh, no, I don't. I, do, I, I go home and watch The Simpsons or something. <laughs> You play a pretty bigoted guy in three billboards. Did yeah, you hesitate? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I get all these rednecks, I, uh, Green Mile. Yeah. <laughs> I play the racist. Yeah, uh, stained right off the bat. So. At least yeah. you don't have to wear the hideous brown teeth that go along with it. <laughs> Tom was very, I was, that was my first, one of my first studio movies. Tom was very generous. Uh, I had a spit in his face. We and he just was, had this guy come yeah. in and just, oh, this genius guy is going to come in and play this other thing. That was a great you, set. That was a Good great movie. set. Was it was like doing set. a play. It was, it, it, yeah. was, it was a bunch of guys who loved each other. We came out of our trailers Listen, for scenes that we were not in in order to watch. What you you, you went to Hollywood like Boulevard to put your hands in the concrete. Oh, yeah. And you yeah. could have gone home. They sent you away, and you came back to well, do off because, camera. You came back to do off camera. That's because Frank Darabont will shoot 16-hour days and eat every meal Yeah, but you could have gone home, and you came back. Yeah. You're, you're, very, you're very generous. <laughs> well, it's very... only three blocks away. <laughs> <laughs> Do you ever feel that um, as actors you're not doing something meaningful enough or, or do you feel that there is a purpose to it? Oh, I think we, I just want to entertain and make people laugh. So I just want to get that check. I just want to <laughs> get the check. Uh, I mean, you know, it's that always Broadway Sam, check. just the Broadway yeah, well, check. You're making those big money choices, Sam, without a yeah. <laughs> Transformers, here I come. Yeah. Mm -hmm. No, but I mean, I, I just, um, I, I don't know, I just kind of want to get it done right and, and show up and, and entertain and, you know, make it, make it good. I mean, you always kind of think you're doing Citizen Kane, you know, <laughs> and nobody, see, nobody sees the movie or sometimes people do see the movie, but I think you think you're doing Hamlet every time and then sometimes it turns out that way, sometimes it doesn't. I think you're trying to do the best thing ever. Ready? Okay, quiet on set. And I look down the lens. Yeah. Let's do it. Hi, I'm John Boyega. I'm Sam Rockwell. Well, I'm Defoe. Emma Stone. Alice and Janney. Thank you. Thanks for watching The Hollywood Reporter. The Hollywood Reporter. The Hollywood Reporter. On YouTube.